Well guys, welcome to episode 3. Today I have a lot in store for y'all. Do check out my previous episodes. I put a lot of work into them and I have the go-kart behind me and today I actually going to be putting my custom built engine on it. I also got some new wheels. I'm going to be building a custom bumper for my go-kart, fixing my steering. And um, there's some little things I have to address and fix in this video. So yeah guys, hopefully y'all are excited for this episode as much as I am. And yeah, let's get right into it. So guys, what I've got here is I fixed up my steering. I've cut out new little uh, joints. I'm still probably going to have to paint them. And I also cut a new length of the steering rod. And I did the same with this right here. So it all steers good. I'm really happy. I mean, it's not 100% perfect, but they'll do the job. I need to weld the bumper to my go-kart. And the reason why is because it's just safety. I'm thinking about doing this two 90 degree band pipes. I'm gonna have them joined together like that. And then I'm gonna weld them to the go-kart. grinding. Well guys, I think I'm almost done with the bumper. I've put some weld over here. So guys, I've ordered parts and uh, most of the parts are already here, but I'm really excited to show y'all the, all the parts and so the problem I'm having with these wheels is that they're too big. Um, they won't go all the way in. I bought them from Go Power Sports. I'm probably going to have to cut my my little arm right there because as y'all can see, I can't even see the, the spindle. Well guys, it's currently night. I just wanted to tell y'all that um, I placed some parts on GoPowerSports.com. Go Power Sports, if you're watching this, please sponsor me. So basically, I've received four wheels like that. Wheels on the front I fixed by shortening this little arm. I also bought the sprocket from Go Power Sports. And theoretically, it should allow me to go much faster. That could mean 60 miles per hour. Guys, it's um, the next day, actually the next next day, and um, I've just been busy, so I couldn't get to my go-kart in time, but right now, my go-kart's sitting back there. I just built the engine for the go-kart a few days ago. Now that's a VM22 Mikuni. Um, go Power Sports sells those, but overall, I've tested it just a little bit. The carburetor is a much better improvement over the stock carburetor. It's not only does it improve the throttle response, it's going to provide a better AF mixture. What I mean by better AF air fuel mixture is that it can squeeze more gas in a small volume of air. And when that once that goes in the engine, the engine will combust more efficiently and it will produce more power. I also removed the governor from the engine. 
I've only tested it a little bit and so far it seems to work. So I put the engine on and I went for a ride and I just want to show y'all something guys. My frame cracked. Yeah. It flexes and that's not really good. I'm gonna put like some kind of metal piece underneath and then I'm gonna weld the crack up so hopefully it doesn't fail me. I put the engine back on, and this thing is a beast. Um, I'm here with my bud Nathan. What's Helping up, guys? Me. I'm gonna give you all some shots and POV rides of this thing. We got the Mikuni on, the exhaust. We have the chain sorted out. We have that frame done. We have this bumper good. So yeah, I have a GoPro. So let's go for a ride and do some drifts. oil and we're gonna pour them on the wheels and do some burnouts. Just to preface this video before the final finale, um, I appreciate y'all watching this video to the end. I do really want to reach my goal, and consider subscribing if you're new, because it'll really help me out. Yeah, let's do it. That was awesome guys! 